Hey, happy Saturday. It's 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 a warm it's a warm one. Uh, it's it's a warm one. I came out here this morning, but I didn't walk because it was already already warm this morning for me. Already warm, uh, and it was humid, ninety eight percent humidity or something like that. It's just gross, uh, and I couldn't. I couldn't, I couldn't put my feet back in those boots this morning, so I drove out here, but then I, I drove home. It was cloudy this morning, so there wasn't anything to look at, you know, sunrise-wise, and it was just, it's just bad. And right now it's 88 degrees and still humid, so um, I am, I'm not in the boots. It, the trail's still, it's drier, it's drier than it has been, um, but it's, oof, I'm not going to take a long walk out of here, I'm just going to take a short walk, but I just want to give you that little update, I hope you guys are doing well, hope you're feeling healthy today, hope it's not nasty where you are, for on either end of the spectrum, hot or cold or wet, um, this is, this is very Texas right here, feeling weather and I, I don't miss it, but anyways, gonna be a short one. I'm going up a hill, so I'm about to start panting, but uh, I'll connect with you guys in a little bit. Love you. Remember this guy from yesterday? I'm as bad at pointing out it today as I was yesterday. Um, I do believe this to be a mulberry tree uh, based on what I was looking at last night. I was looking at different, you know, the flowers. These things so a mulberry I've never seen a mulberry before that's new to me uh, we are in the growing region for mulberries they do grow here I'm getting out of the sun because that's unpleasant um, and mulberries you can eat there he is um, so the only unfortunate thing is that there's like three branches that are low enough for me to reach so that mulberry is for the birds, but I will keep an eye out. There might be more of those. There's one, uh, also high branches. Um, so I don't know how how you get the berries. Do you just wait for them to fall to the ground and then pick them up, or do you take them off the tree? I'm not quite certain, but uh, yeah, I'm I'm mostly sure that that's a mulberry tree, and they're a popular fruit uh, from the lookings that I did online. There's all kinds of uses for that berry people like it a lot i also looked at recipes for you know if you ever want to know how to eat something or if something's edible you just look up recipes for it there the may apple found a, i found a few so there there are uh, things to do with that and um so that's that's an option so i may i may very well i'm, I'm gonna pick some of them um you don't eat the seeds, you do cut the ends off the fruit, the stem end and the flowering end off the fruit. Uh, a lot of people pull, grind them into pulp uh, or they'll use them as like a preserves. Uh, they're said to have a strong flavor, so a little bit goes a long way. Uh, but we'll see, they say you can eat them raw. You just don't eat the seeds, you know, get the seeds out because they're toxic, so. Anyways, that's that's me today just a nice short walk and I'm getting sweaty and uh, I'm trying out a different footwear option so we'll see if I feel pretty good about it they uh, they got a little bit sticky but not like the boots so anyways I'll see you guys later all right we're gonna wrap this one up with a little bit of backyard exploration we've got this I believe is burdock it is furry so it might be oh what was that mullein or something like that um, which I don't know if it's burdock it's been used as a root vegetable and can be eaten um, I didn't realize that these were as fuzzy as they are, so I didn't research the other thing that it could have been. But I also have these guys over here, and these are cute little things. 
Mm. These have popped up in this spot in the yard, but they're also everywhere. Uh, the neighborhood's, everybody's yard has these in them. They, I believe they're Star of Bethlehem. They're just cute little things. But, uh, what is this? These are all the weeds. This is the, what I have in lieu of a lawn. So this is, this almost looks like a mint, but I don't, they could also be a thistle. So I don't, I'm not gonna touch them too much because they do look like they might have some pokies on there. And they have some tiny hairs on the stem, so I'm not gonna touch those. But anyways, it's hot still, it's 96 degrees. Uh, humidity has dropped significantly since this morning. It's, it says it's 25%, but I don't know. It's still plenty warm, so. Anyways, that's that's my day. Got the house cleaned. I need to vacuum and mop and that's left. But it's been a great day for being inside. I love you guys. I'll see you later.